hello family you're welcome back to my youtube channel and if this is the first time of coming across my channel my name is samuel joshua and this is the voice of zion hub logistics here we are like family we discuss everything that have to do with e-commerce arbitrage and how you can make money online but our channel talks mostly about mini importation business how to start mini importation business all right so you can do well to join our channel by subscribing to our youtube channel if you are a first timer please it is free to subscribe to our channel all right so and if you are a return subscribers you guys are awesome thank you guys for coming back to watch our youtube videos each time we drop a helpful content like this all right so um, in today's tutorial, I've been having a lot of messages recently, like people normally message me, right? So they told me to record a video that I've already recorded in few years ago. They said the video wasn't clear and it's, there are some points that was hanging there. So I need to take my time to record this video again. So it will be able to be a setup, which is how to connect your alipay with your 168 account all right i've recorded this video before but something is not um there are some things i need to add up and there are some recent developments from alipay and 168 which i wish to tell you in the in the in this video so you won't be able to do a mistake okay so there are two different methods that i'm going to be showing you in this tutorial on how to connect your 168 with your alipay do well to watch the video to the very end and make sure you don't skip any part of it at all all right so without further more ado let's dive into the tutorial now this is my new alipay account for those of us that have just gotten our new alipay verified and now we want to connect it to 1688 so we'll be able to make payment directly now in a very quick one this is a new account here you can see that it is just verified and if i'm to click on balance you will see that here we have zero 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 and nothing has been done with this account but i will always advise you here if you are trying to connect it please make sure you've done with the necessary settings on your alipay in terms of the payment password set your payment password add an email address to the account then also set your login details that is very very much important okay so once you are done setting up the needful here now the next thing we want to do is to head over to our 1688 so if you don't know how to get your 1688 app you can either get it if you are using an iphone which is ios you can get it on app store on app store you get it to download it directly but if you are using an android you can get it via the website i'm going to be leaving a video below that link on how to download 168 hub all right so now some people don't know how to get these things um connected okay now we have two different methods that you can use to connect your 168 account to your alipay all right now i'm going to be taking you the um through the first one and we are going to be doing the second one practically now for those of us that falls under the category of those who have already created um 168 accounts like you have already gotten it and you don't know how to now connect it with your alipay so you'll be able to be using the two together that one is also possible if you've already have an existing 168 account that will prompt me to link it under the description button again and i'm also going to leave it under the comment section on how you can link your existing 168 account with your alipay that is the first method i've already recorded the video on it so please go and watch it carefully now the second one which is the general method here please watch carefully as i start now you see where we have this alipay we are going to be connecting now we are not doing the registration we just want to connect it with our alipay account so you want to click on this alipay account here you click on it 
so it will automatically direct you you can see here is directing me back to my alipay so once it directs me to back to my alipay now what i need to do is to give this thing authentication i need to confirm and login so i'll click on confirm and login now and it's going to do what go back redirect me to 1688 redirect me back to alipay to confirm that i'm the real owner of this account do you get it so once it gets to that page now it will redirect you to your 1688 and this is what is going to be bringing but guys in some cases it's not going to be showing this simply because um you've already connected it and it has already bind with that alipay so it's going to tell you that it's going to be bringing something like number for you to confirm the code just click on that orange icon how i which is going to show me here so i can give you a detailed explanation on it but however it is something we are familiar with so once you click on it it will now send the code to that number once it send the code to that number directly you will input the code then click on that orange button so it will log you in directly automatically without any stress but in this case now it's not bringing that one so you will just click on this you will check in this box here once you check in that box then you click on this orange icon here so automatically now it's going to log you in directly without any hazard at all that is the new and the latest method but in case there are some phones now this is with bravo this is what i'm trying to tell you the other time this is the settings that i'm telling you the other time now all right now this is what is going to be showing thank god it really brings this page now this is the number that was connected to the alipay account so you are going to click on this orange icon here once you click on this orange icon a code will be sent directly to this number so you want to input it and click on this orange icon here that is very very simple but before we get this done now this is what happened in some cases at the point of you trying it they will freeze your account it's not as if you are not following the deal process it is alipay and once it's it is like they have their own policies so it's not just that you are not doing it right don't panic please there's a way around it if your 1688 is frozen without even doing anything please there is a way we can do it but is um it's not what we can teach because that's not part of the tutorial for today please reach out to me on whatsapp if you fall under the category of those people that during the process your alipay account or your 1688 account was frozen if you fall under that, those category yes we can reactivate it and you can also use your alipay and 1688 again there is another way we can do it all right now let's proceed to get this code to this number so automatically now we've already created that account so it will just take me in directly you can see here that it has taken me in and to confirm that this account has successfully been created let me just click on me here and you can see that this is what we have we have the tb automatically is going to generate your taobao username it's going to generate your taobao username for you directly and you can see that this is new account nothing has been done on this account all right so i've recorded the video now you can use pay for me and chat their customer care representative so it's likely i link some of those video under the description of this video so